Are you afraid to go outside in the dark, even in your own neighborhood? A new poll by Gallup shows Americans are fearing for their personal safety, and it's a 30-year high. I mean, this is not surprising. Uh, crime is up in so many cities, so many of our communities. Four in ten people say they're afraid to walk alone at night within just a mile from their house. Kelsey is here with more on this story and the poll numbers. Kelsey. Adrian and Markey, good morning. Well, this really shows that Americans, according to this Gallup poll, they do not feel safe. The last time we saw this level of concern about crime was back in 1993, which Gallup points out was, quote, one of the worst crime waves in U.S. history. The poll revealed that a significant number of Americans believe that the country has a serious crime problem. And they actually think it's gotten worse over the past year. This all comes despite the FBI reporting that the violent crime has fallen slightly compared to last year, and murder rates are actually down 6%. And for the last 30 years, the percentage of Americans who said they feared walking alone at night hovered around 35%. 35%. But that number has jumped up to 40% most recently. A whopping 53% of women said they don't feel safe walking at night. That is a stark contrast to 26% of men. Gallup has said that they've been asking this specific question to gauge how safe Americans feel since 1965. The record high was 48% back in January of 1982, when the crime, crime and murder rates were making headlines in New York City. According to the poll, Americans actually felt the safest back in October of 2020, during the first year of the pandemic, when many people were socially distancing at the time. But those concerns for safety jumped back up to pre-pandemic levels by 2021. And of course, crime and what should be done about it, especially in major cities, is expected to be one of the top issues among voters in next year's election. Marky and Adrian. All right. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.